Uh, this piece is called uh, Ocean Library um, and it's a charcoal drawn on paper. Um, I conceived of the whole piece, so the whole idea around vestige of being a kind of cyclical, having a cyclical quality to it. Um, and by that I mean, I'll explain, I meant using the materials and the subject matter and everything kind of turned into a cycle for me. So to explain that, um, I used charcoal to make this. I made the charcoal myself using driftwood that I picked up on the beach in Whitestown up, uh, up near Dundalk and Carlingford. So it was kind of thrown up. I seen it as being a, a vestige or a remains of a process and an energy that was thrown up on the beach, these little pieces of driftwood. Um, I didn't know what I was getting because I don't know what kind of wood any of that is. So I made my own charcoal by, you know, you put it in the can, put it in a fire high heat, take it out and it's black charcoal and it's great and you can make all sorts of marks with it. So what I wanted to do was um, make some drawings of the, the element or the element that produced the charcoal. So there was like a whole double, triple thing going on there. Um, so I took myself to the west coast of Ireland to do them because I thought, yeah, you know, the cliffs are more, there's lots, some really ravishing kind of waves and it's really dramatic and I can make make the drawings from that and I actually I did lots of drawings of waves but I actually the drawing ended up quite still um, because when I was like drawing on the cliffs it was actually the the rock formations that really got my attention um, and again they're another vestige of elements so these they're they're just so beautiful and they look so soft and so kind of um, fresh even though they're something like 300 million years in the making. Um, you know, there's these beautiful curves and folds, they're all just layered up and they actually do remind me of books and pages in a book. Um, and what they'll actually tell you, if you can, if you know the language, you can read the stories and the history of 300 million years of life and energy and elemental forces working on them. So um, that's how I came to produce this image. Um, and. Uh, it was kind of focusing on those, so um, on the on those layers. So again, they're a vestige of. So we've got all the elements in there. There's fire and water and earth and air went into the production of these, and that's a vestige of that kind of energy working through the world. Mm -hmm.